This Chaos Apex series is this title. Is this I have finally got created my Chaos by um custom Xenomorphs. Well, not all of them. All right, so I got four of the Queen packages um yesterday, and I was only build, able to build um two of the smaller ones, which I will tell you their names in the next video, or I'll bring it up now. And now, but like these two boxes that get those boxes, my brother, not the pieces, but like the box. Tomorrow we'll be creating Apex Xeno Alien. Because the energy and time frame. I just want to watch all the videos today and just relax. The muscle memory. Did you know building Megasaurus can burn energy? I did not know that. Anyway, yeah, so Apex is not here. But you, the next one you'll see is the other ones. Alright, so as a display here, I have created. So yesterday I created two of the smaller guard types. But today I have finished. I have finally created Rogue Alien. And as you see here, he has destroyed the high. He's killed the dead. Cut some Xenomorphs in half. You just see more. Oh no, maybe maybe some real real lighting will help. All right, this better. Oh yeah, so he just murdered these xenomorphs left and right, killing facehuggers. He killed one of the creations that I made yesterday. We'll get more detail. The, the second one's similar, but it's more spikier. It would not. This alien was clearly damaged in battle, from to die horribly. The pretty another alien is currently from the die is dying. The Praetorian knows he is. Mess. He is not. She's not gonna win against this dude. Okay, he can count the other wrath ones. And I guess I can go ahead and tell you what I call, what these are. Too, I guess. So yesterday I made these two. And these are wrath xenos, though there is some minor differences. But I'll go over those differences of the wrath xenos. Um, maybe later on today on the video, depending on how long this uploads. I want to take the uploads, and I'll go back here. And yes, I am gonna go over the features of this. And you see the come here. And as you can see. Epically, it is larger. Cause you can see how I made the legs and the positioning. So, well, uh, so of course I took ideas from the Rogue Alien itself and King Alien, and I talked about the one that we would have got if Alien Five became a thing. The one which also would we also would have ended up getting stronger Xenomorphs because now we would have complete whole Xenomorphs like having a male fertilized eggs or something. You know, you know, just little funny things that could have happened. You know, but they didn't. But you know, that's not that's not a bad thing. Maybe that would have tra traumatized the Xenomorphs. I don't know. But yeah, and then you know, there'll probably be more customs I'll come up with. So, ah, this is not a display. I, I may or may not display it like this. I'm not sure. We'll have to see. I'm exhausted. So, but first, um, hmm, I don't want to show these because this is not about them. So let's put down for dealing. So first, we're gonna go over this, and then I guess. We will scale um, the queen up against him, or whatnot. <clears throat> so of course, Rogue and I had to follow the instructions how to make my Xena queen completely, nearly to the letter. Where of course I had to make modifications during the process. You know here, <laughs> tail is pretty much the same. These are the opposite direction of the queens. Uh, I, I manipulated the leg a little bit and I mean I will have her standing side by side by him so y'all can see the differences majorly um, here's his back spines and then of course here's um, the head crest like that when I want to get more little spine for him but it just wouldn't look right I uh, could no you didn't get here Tusk, and then you have the way I have the arm set up. Hmm. What's going on in there? Hold up, y'all. I got my favorite thing. Okay. It better not be who. Oh, it's just wrong. Wait, Jazavi, are you hungry? Jazavi, are you hungry? Come on. Alright. There's those noodles down here, Fussy. Yes, he's been hooking up with all of his face, been bothering me and getting the noodles off of me. Alright. Alright, viewers, I'm going to pause the video. 
I'm going to pause the video until after I cook his noodles. All right, y'all, so I'm going to pause the video for now, and then once I get the noodles done or in the process of cooking, I'll come back, continue on, and while I watch the noodles bubble, I'll pause again. So, yeah. Why not just wait till the noodles get done? Uh, the video was already started, Mom. I'm already five minutes in. Look, Mom, it's right. I redo the whole video. Why? It's yeah. taking forever for them to get the box. Huh? I mean, it's taking forever for them to do all this. I might as well, I already want to do these videos. Might as well go for the articulation. Whatever it is. Whatever it is. Anyway, and then here's the chest piece. As of course, y'all know he doesn't have the little inner link arms. And whatnot. Um, the articulation is pretty much, well... The same as a queen. And what, now, and what, what I find funny when I was creating him is that just like how I was confirming and manipulating parts of how the queen looked to make a rogue alien, is exactly how rogue alien really was cannily created because his whole base buy is based off a of queen and whatnot, and it made male in control. Because the, what they wanted to do for rogue alien was have it control xenomorphs because, you know, when you talk, always got to make them soldiers. And, of course, that. But, you know, instead of making an alien that... Uh, uh, or, uh, the a, a patriarch that controls Xenomorphs, the his army, they create a, a super soldier thing that attacks Xenomorphs at will and ignored humans unless provoked. Apparently. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm gonna pause here and then if I'm gonna put the news in the pot, now I'm gonna unpause. All right. Back and unpause. All right. So while the news cooking, we got time. All right. So hmm. I guess I do side by side. Hmm. Um, these customs may be a lot shorter in video than I thought I would, but maybe, maybe I'll show, like, random slideshows of them, like, posing up, maybe? It's been a while, so I can just take pictures and do the slideshow and then upload that. So, I'm gonna, um, oh. Now, Apex, I mean, like, I don't want to be too copy, but this is me initiating a challenge of more. Against the sawtooth alien person. So as y'all can see here is the the two leading cast. I believe so. Let me have the queen. Hold on, let me have the queen more posted up here. Y'all can look through the three ones right here. But what I'm gonna have to have this opened up real quick. Queen Zemos is smaller, but not by that much in the canon sense, and like in canon, like in now for my figure wise, if I properly have it here and have their heads try to meet up, and then yeah, this act this is a actually accurate sizing to like the comics. Yeah, yeah. Let's stay up to the queen and then get the, the rogue alien, which was, was nicknamed Alien King. <laughs> Which, in a sense, I guess he can be like the king, like have a loogie off of Fair to lose. If y'all don't know what Fair to lose, you don't get the reference. But the loogie was a dragon king, the last one. Well, technically, Nas is the last one. The the the, 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 the dragon king before Nazi. And he he was just killing everything, Dra other dragons. Kill. He was specifically going for other dragons to kill. And then you know he was killing everything, humans, and all that. He didn't care. But yeah, as you can see, I just see the stereotypical queen's leg, and then how how I altered it, make it larger. Cause I was like, of all things, I had to find a way to alter the flipping um, legs. Otherwise, it was not going to be the accurate sizing of how it is. And I think I haven't done myself, cause you know, it dude looks like some interesting. And I don't like it. And I'm actually happy with my achievement. Another reason why I'm, um, because like I said, I'm going to watch videos, and I might do another video when I show you my Wrath aliens. But, you know, this is not for them. They Rogue is the first one I wanted to show. And the only reason why he wasn't created yesterday is because my packages came at 7.45. So, that was too late in the day to try to make him. So, I just went ahead and made them. So next video will be um the rafts and then some and they may or may not up be uploaded tomorrow depending on how long this takes to upload. Um, 
I'm probably going to make Apex tomorrow. They'll, if I'm energized and not exhausted later on today, after making the video, them all that, then I'll probably, then I'll probably get to work on him. It. Well, it's going to, well, it's going to be a, this is going to be a, a, a natural Xeno, so, her. And we'll see how that works. Because really, I think the only thing I'm really going to be following book by book is, like, the body. Which, you know, of course, got to add my little twist or whatnot. And then, um, the head crest. Everything else. Oh, and I guess the tail. But everything else is going to be by, by my, my design completely. Though, of course, I got base info from the Sawtooth family. So, yeah. So like, subscribe, and as always, let the chaos guide you.